to the house, feeling kind of lost, searching for the treasures at any cost. Walmart's employees, where did they go? Socializing instead of putting on a show. Oh, the shelves are bare, lost in this despair. Another optic video, let me take a look. 4K Blu-ray magic, let's not overlook. UPS is tossing packages like it's a game, but physical media still holding the flame. The flame. Hey everybody out there, welcome back for another video. Uh, I just realized something pretty cool. David, I don't know if you ever actually watched my videos, dude. But this is a movie I already have on Vudu, and I have the 4K copy. So I'm going to be sending this over to you tonight. Um, and that's the Ministry of Ungentlemanly Warfare um, here on 4K Blu-ray and digital copy. I did not see this in theaters. It's not that I didn't want to. I just just wasn't high on my list to see, I guess. And now I kind of wish I had seen it. It's from Lionsgate. Um, it's based on a true story. It's really well done. Um... It's got really good actors in here. Uh, we'll take a look at the back, and I'll go over the special features with you, which aren't a lot. Um, the only ones they have listed on the back here are the Ministry of Filmmaking theatrical trailer, um, and then it's rated R, and running time here, I don't know, it felt, it felt short, to be honest, but it's 120 minutes long, so I guess it's not that short. Um, but I love Henry Cavill. I think he's a great actor. So, you know. I can't think of anything he's done that I haven't liked. I even liked, um, The Man from Uncle. And I thought his cameo in Deadpool versus Wolverine, or Deadpool and Wolverine was pretty cool as well. So let's go ahead and open it up here. Like I said, David, I will send that code over to you. But I can't trust that it won't be used if I show it. Um, but on the inside, you've got two uh, discs with Henry Cavill standing, standing in front of flames. Um, but that's it for my unboxing, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you all later. I think I actually bought this one. Um, like last week or something. I just haven't opened it up yet. Uh, but anyways, I'll see you later. Bye.